I don't want, at the end of the day, I don't want you to end up losing your account. There's a couple of routine procedures I need to go through. Okay. And that is either that your account gets temporarily banned for two weeks for violent and abusive language, or alternatively, if you're under the age of 18, I'll have to speak to a parent or guardian, in which case your account wouldn't be banned. I just have to speak to a parent or guardian for approximately two or three minutes. Yeah, I, like I said, I'm going to deal with people one by one. But um, first of all, is there any chance I could speak to maybe a parent or guardian? Yeah, I'll call that. Okay, can you just put your mum on the... What's your mum's name, please? Tracy. Tracy, can you put Tracy back on the on the on the line? Hello. Hello, Tracy. Yeah. Hello. Um, I'm afraid I actually work, for <laughs> and I've been playing Black Ops 2 multiplayer, as obviously you're aware your son also plays. Yeah. Yes, and yeah. Um, unfortunately, I came across him using a lot of foul and abusive language, which right, okay. unfortunately is actually breaching one of the terms when you're playing with other members of the public online. Right, okay. I was wondering if you were aware of this? No, I didn't realise, no. Okay, um, can I give you some examples of some of the words he was using against other players? Right, okay. Okay, so obviously we're starting off with some of the basic ones. Shit. Yeah. Fuck. Right. And the C word. Right, okay then. Right, no, I don't, I don't accept that now. You, you don't? No, so... No, I was no, um, obviously yeah. He's not allowed. I, und I understand that this obviously, as your son, this is not really great to be able to hear that he's using such horrible language and... Okay then, yeah, I understand. I'll have a word for them. And as well as that, there was some there were some camos that he had for his guns. I'm not sure if you're aware of how the Black Ops 2 camo system works. No, I don't, know. Okay, so um, when you've got a gun, you have a camouflage and... For some reason, unknown to many of, obviously, my co-workers and the people at Activision, the creators of the game, he had pornographic camouflage. Right, okay, I didn't know that, no. So, he must have either downloaded this from the internet, or he is using some sort of hack within the P PlayStation 3, sorry, in order to get these. So, I was wondering if maybe you could have a word with him, just to... Yes, yes, I will, yeah. Yeah. No, I, I was oh. Right, I wasn't aware of that, no. Um, what's your sort of view on stuff like this? Obviously, as a parent, I'm sure you don't want your child to be watching pornography and swearing on the PlayStation Network. No, he doesn't do things like that, no. I wasn't aware of the camouflage. Well, where did you get it from? Where did you get it from? You said it came when you, when you do a challenge. No, I'm afraid there is actually no pornographic camouflage which comes up when you pass a challenge on Black Ops 2, so I'm afraid he's trying to cover the cover your eyes here with um with troll material. Right, okay. You said it's there right in front of him. Where's what's it called? Ghost Tex Delta G. No, the the Ghost Tex camo is not the camouflage he had on his weapon. The wep the camouflage he had on his weapon was actually a woman trying to pleasure her vagina. Right, okay then. Well, whose gun was it then? He's going through his weapons here, show me what he's got. We've got one that you shouldn't have. Look, I think the only way we can go around this is if it's obviously not on the game, it's something he's downloaded online, so I'm thinking that maybe some better security protection so that he cannot access any of these sites because right. some of the images that were appearing on his guns were just. Okay then, right, okay. I'd... Well, I don't want to talk. Right, okay. Can you just put your mum back on the line for a couple more moments, please, and then we'll be done here. Right, okay. Yes, hello? Okay, so, I'm sorry to have to bring this to your attention today, but, um... How big are your boobs? What's that got to do with that? What are you asking me that for? It's actually a company policy to ask you this question. How big are your boobs? I'm not telling you. Are they, are they big? Are they small? I'm not telling you. <laughs> oh, that was the best. That was the best thing. That was the best thing I ever heard. That was the best. 
So then ladies and gents, hope you all enjoyed my video today. If you did, be sure to leave a like rating. I can try to get some more mums on the mic in the future. As well as that, I want to point you guys in the direction of my upcoming Q&A video. I will not be taking questions from the comment section of this video. I'll be taking questions from Twitter. So if you don't already, be sure to follow me on Twitter. The link is in the top of the description. If you have any questions for me, leave it with the hashtag AskBuffalo on my Twitter account. But anyway guys, thank you for watching and sending your questions. Goodbye.